So currently, uh, today, Sunday, is mow the yard day. Shelly's over there running the rider in a bikini. Woohoo! <coughs> and I'm getting ready to hoe. I done weed eat it. But, um, uh, Uh, weed eater only lasts like 15 minutes, so re it's a rechargeable weed eater. I'm trying to get stuff out of the yard too, here and there, and pick stuff for the uh, pick stuff for the, the rabbits, and and getting ready to weed eat or uh, hope hoe some in the garden and hopefully if I have time I'm gonna build the uh, build the dog a more proper dog house out of pallets um, yeah we got a lot of stuff going on this weekend too um, yesterday was moving day we uh, we moved her most of her a lot of her stuff still got something to move but um Yesterday was moving day, so we didn't really much done. Oh, look at that zucchini. Holy crap. Yeah, we're pulling that today. That one and this one over here. I mean, that's like twice the size as it was yesterday. It's crazy. I put these trellises up for the... I need another uh, bigger post on the that one for the tomatoes because it's really flimsy in the middle. I've got two, like two and a half foot posts or something. Oh my gosh, look at these. Look at those. They wasn't, they was like half that size yesterday, I swear. Look at that. And we pulled a couple of squash off over here and here, look. One's pretty much about ready there, getting real close. Um, what we got here? More squash, more zucchini. There's another huge zucchini on there. Holy crap. Uh, yeah, the garden's doing pretty good. See how the beans are doing. They were getting close. Oh, yeah. They're probably ready now. I don't know if there's enough there, but they're about ready. All right. Sounds like she's taking a break. So, nearing the end of our homestead, or nearing the end of our Sunday on the homestead. There's, uh, yeah, Mr. Gray. He's crazy gray. Look at him. 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 Anyways. I'll put this out here just for something to sit on and stuff. Uh... She bought a new peach tree for really cheap. They were uh, like and we're, I'm supposed to be starting charcoal here. Um, anyways, the peach tree, tree was like really cheap. It's not starting very good. Whoa, yeah, hell yeah, it's not starting. Alright then. Hopefully it'll keep going. So we mowed the yard today, bought a peach tree, I've been weeding, you can't tell it from this, but I'm letting purslane and um, some lamb's quarter like kind of go rampant, so there's lettuce in there and then there's pumpkins as you can see, or uh, uh, watermelons as you can see, um, may have to thin out the, we're going to actually cook up some of the purslane tonight with beans and squash. We actually picked some beans off the uh, bush beans today. There wasn't enough for beans just by themselves, so we're going to cook something up. And there's, there's the bunnies. They're going to town on some mulberry and mulberry bush and whatever else. I don't know. Threw all kinds of crap in there. Weeded out the lettuce. We're going to have some lettuce tonight on hamburgers. Got the onions growing. And these, uh, I already just showed you those earlier. The zucchini are crazy 
she pulled off one, one of the squashes and there you can see there's still a few of them going pretty good there's peppers weed them out a little bit still needs a little bit of weeding there's some peppers growing um, my tomatoes are just blossoming for the most part. None of them have um, anything really going on. There's marigold. Focus, focus, focus. These are my biggest tomato plants. And they're just, like I said, so far they're just blossoming, not doing much else. I need to pull the suckers off. Um, broccoli, I think. And cabbage, which is getting eaten. I'm gonna have to get some diatomaceous earth or something going on. Keep them from getting destroyed. Uh, yeah, we mowed the yard today. The lawn mower, the push mower, um, just give me give me problems. And she's planted a bunch of stuff over here. I can't hardly tell what she's done actually. There's some peas here, I think. Uh, she kind of does some crazy hoeing or something. There's beets that he just ran across, and then there's peas there. More beets down here. And then more peas, beets and peas mostly. There's some other stuff growing there, but I'm not sure where it's at. And we stopped mowing here today got to mow through the garden the corn is kind of sketchy um, it's come up here and there some places hasn't come up this all needs weeded out working on that probably work on it tomorrow um, there's one thing of corn there and there's also two more up here and we're about to do some more tilling as long as we get some decent days like this where it's not real crazy yeah, here's more corn and sunflowers in these two lots. Needs weeded again. Potatoes need hilled up like quickly and weeded. Um, there's actually some tomatoes in here, but they are just barely here. Here's one right there. There's some tomatoes. There's some tomatoes all down through here. Some peppers and the beans are doing good if they haven't gotten eaten off by rabbits. I seen the rabbits or something had, had eaten some of them off. And she dug up some uh, <coughs> day lilies and <coughs> planted them over here. I ought to see if I can get her to fritter some of those up. I might do that here in a second. Um, it's, it's the other potatoes are coming up too. I thought they was, they was having trouble, but right there are some coming up. Here's the beans. Beans are going, beans are going, beans are going. Beans are doing good. Needs needs weeded. Beans, 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 beans. But I've noticed these ones for some reason. There's some more they've eaten off, eating the tops right off. It's either cut worms or or rabbits eating them on them. A few of them. Through here, they got a few of them too. I think. So I don't know, I'm going to set here to make Mr. Gray follow me around. Mow the trail. Uh, Got to mow this. Hell, if I feel spunky, I may turn on, turn to get the riding mower and mowing dark. Who knows? And I'm wanting to um, mow some more of that, a little bit more of that, and start tilling it for next year. I'm not probably not going to plant anything in it, but I want to start um, tilling up, I don't know, from right about here to halfway back. Till up this whole plot right through here and do corn and, and uh, maybe pumpkins or something back in so far here. That's a pretty big chunk of corn. That's going to be next year's plan. That's, and we're going to try to get started on it this year. So, probably... I mean, that's going to be a pretty pretty big hunk of garden. Pretty big hunk of corn from basically where I'm at. All the way to over there. 
and about. About this wide. So that's a pretty big chunk of she's planting a tree over there. I don't know if I showed it to you guys or not. Uh, I got some sunflowers growing there. There's some pumpkins there in those hills. And he's weeded. He's weeded. Pumpkins weeded. And there's some other crap growing in between them. I think she plants crazy stuff like uh, carrots and peppers or something. I don't know if any of them's coming up or not. But um, it all needs weeded. Blah blah blah. It all needs weeded. So I'm gonna try to set up a permanent shelter over there. Just a t permanent tarp shelter to keep keep it up. Since we put the um, sectional up there to basically let it get destroyed, but enjoy it while it's there. We put that picnic table out here. Like I said, I plan on putting a different tarp up there and I've had the tent up. But I'm going to put a, like a little permanent tarp up there just to chill under or whatever. So that's what's going on. It looks like the smoker's finally going. And um, let's see. I don't know if you guys saw this, got a little garden table. I still haven't finished my project of uh, cleaning this out and organizing it as well as I want to. Got some um, uh, feed for the quail. And brought these beds over from her house. Um, we're not going to plant anything in them, but we're going to start getting them ready this year. And there's my boy, Scooby. Scooby has learned to sit. I don't know if he'll sit with... There you go. That's a good boy. That's a good dog. You did it without a treat even. Yes, that's good. Try it again. Hang on. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, he's excited. Come here. Okay, Sit. Good boy. That's a good dog. I'll go get you a treat. Yes, I will. Oh, easy. Easy greasy. Clean this area out a little bit today, too. Not totally done, but cleaned out. Looks like they need fed, so I'll have to get on that. Or rather, looks like I got a little bit. They need, they need fed. You're a good boy. All right, so that's the, that's the the progress this Sunday on the homestead. Taught the dog to sit, mowed the yard, hoed, weed eated, blah blah blah. Now we're getting to eat, getting ready to eat. See what all she's cooking. Hey, what were you cooking us? Um, hamburgers, french fries, and then I'm sauteing uh, this yellow squash, green beans, and you said you were going to put purse lane. Purse lane, squash, green beans, sauteed, and hamburgers with with garden lettuce on it. On it. And french fries. Sure, absolutely. I'm just I'm making a YouTube video and I was letting them know what the menu was. Oh, okay. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi, hi. YouTube. Okay. Love you. Love you. Look at the babies. Alright, we got some cheeseburgers, toasted buns, some lettuce from the garden. Some french fries, homemade french fries, some squash, green beans from the garden, and the squash is from the garden. Yeah, I forget what else is in it. Green beans, minced garlic, and butter. Butter. And I'm going to throw some raw purslane in there. I picked it too late, but I'm, I'm going to eat it raw. I don't care. Yep. Yeah, boy. <laughs>